Is it? Why isn't it working? Oh, hello? Can you hear me now? Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. Now my mic wants to work. Good evening, all of my fellow gamers, memers, streamers, and dreamers. Welcome to the stream. It's your boy, Nikita, back at it again for another week of awesome Amazon sales and amazing products that we have to show you today. I am your hosty with the mosty, but no toasty, Nikita. And, 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 and Nate, it wasn't muted. I don't know what. I didn't even change the audio device. It just didn't want to work. I think my... Like, it's been doing this weird thing where I think that, like, my mic is, like, dying or something. I need to... Oh, the gain is low. Oh, d I didn't change the settings, though. That's so weird. It's been acting... It's been acting funky lately. Is it better now? Uh, maybe it works now. It's been acting funky, though. Also, what's up, Evans? What's up, buy things? What's up? Ew, Nate. Ugh, ugh. But he's here. I, I guess I'll say hi to Nate. <laughs> um... But welcome to the stream, everyone. Happy to have you guys here. I uh, it is a, another wonderful week uh, to be streaming to Amazon. I uh, I have been quite lay busy. Much sounds such loud. Let's see why you greet Evans before me when I say when I was the first to say so because in the order of recently received messages to the earliest messages, I saw his name first. Um, but anyways, we have a lot of cool products to uh, show you guys today. A lot that I've covered, uh, some Nate has done, some James has done. So a little bit from everyone. We even have like a deer product tonight. Uh, Merle shows up in the stream once and Demetrius shows up in the, in the stream also. But, uh, the first three products that we have are products that I have on hand uh, ready to show you. I haven't installed them yet, and that's why I have them on hand, uh, because I don't have a video for them just yet, but I will have a video for them soon. Uh, the first, uh, they're all, they're all Real Link, um, which basically Real Link makes really cool security devices and stuff, and so, um, the first one is this really cool 4K security outdoor camera, um, and there is currently a $20 clickable coupon on the page for it, uh, but I still have it in the box, basically, right here it comes they come in these really nice white and blue boxes which i kind of enjoy i'm gonna tilt my camera down so i can kind of show you the stuff that comes with it let's go also uh for those of you who've taken a peek further into the carousel um there is the super slide in there tonight which means i get to play another level of super slide on stream and i absolutely love and enjoy getting to play super slide on stream but as you can see here, this is basically everything that it comes with. It comes with a nice little pack of screws for the mounting set for it uh, so that you can put it into the wall wherever you may put, be putting it. I think I'm going to put this one on the inside. Um, it only requires – I was talking to Justin about it. So um, it is compatible with the Real Link NVR, which is basically like a little um, control box for it essentially. Uh, but you don't have – to need you don't have to have the hub to use it you can just plug the uh into the router with an ethernet cord uh it just depends on where you want to put it like i'm gonna be putting mine outside so to run it with it or if i were to put it outside rather uh to do it you'd need an like an ethernet cord to be able to run from the outside to the inside which can be difficult for some people um so i'm gonna put mine on the inside just so it's easier to run that ethernet ethernet cord to it uh just for you know the purposes of making the video for it um it also comes with a really kind of chonky instruction manual uh so that you can um you know make sure everything is set up properly um it comes with a few little clip guards uh and cord guards and then the actual camera itself which this is a hefty little monster but it looks really cool like you can see um, that it has the nice little LEDs around it, which makes it really good for uh, night vision and, and seeing stuff with light. It also has a speaker on the bottom of it, which you can use to project your voice out of it. Surprise giveaway. Nikita's giving away all of his life. I... <laughs> Psych! <laughs> um, and then it has this uh, nice little cord at the bottom, which one of them... Uh, we'll give it power. One of them plugs into the hub, and then this one is for the actual uh, Ethernet cord itself. And so you could um, be able to plug it in and view it 
uh, wired. Now, what's cool about this one is this one is definitely the strongest, the highest mega pixelage out of all of them. Uh, but the only disadvantage to it is that it is actually, like I said, it's it's wired. It's not a wireless one, so you have to make sure that you plug it into your Ethernet, uh, your Ethernet into the router. Um, and so that's the only downside to it. But if you could really consider that a downside, but I'm really excited to see the high quality of it. Also. What's up, Wiley? Welcome to the stream. Happy to have you here. And James is here, too. James is here. Um, let's see. He said, you know, what's funny about James is, like, I always understand what he's saying whenever he types. But J no one has more typos in their messages than James. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so that was the first Real Link uh, product. The next one is really cool. This one is uh, wireless or wired. Uh, which makes it a little bit uh, very interesting. And it, it is also solar powered. And this one has one of the most unique solar panels that I've ever seen. Like I've seen quite a few solar panels from different products, but this one is, um, is um, a little different. Let me get it open real quick. But yeah, slide open. This is uh one of the um the most like unique yo you'll see what I'm talking about. Also, this one comes with a really nice um a really nice uh, guide. Also, um also what's up, Boston Butterfly? Welcome to the stream. Uh, hold on one second. All right, there we go. Okay, so uh this is the okay. So this is like a little guard that you put the um the antenna. This little antenna is what you basically screw in to the camera itself, which you see right here. And so, uh, you know, you screw it in right here and this is what allows it the wireless connection F for lightsabers. Oh no, no, no. Nate, Nate's 100% lying. A hundred percent. Like I wouldn't give my, I wouldn't give my lightsabers to my girlfriend or like my mom. Like, no, <laughs> he's, he, <laughs> he baited you by things. <laughs> Um, and then of course it has this really cool, like little mounting bracket for it too, that also comes with different plugs for charging it and stuff and some other mounting screws and everything so that you can have everything mounting it together, um, and setting it up. But now what I really want to show you guys is like I said, uh, uh, the really unique solar panel that this thing has. And you'll see what I'm talking about. It looks like... I don't even know how to describe it, but you see, like I've never seen a solar panel like this before. The only reason you showed up is for a purple lightsaber. Oh, I'm sorry. You know what, James? Maybe one day for your birthday, I'll get you a purple lightsaber. But uh, yeah, it's like, it's the, it's basically the material on the surface of it that I've like never encountered before a solar panel like this. I don't know if James and Nate um, <clears throat> have seen solar panels like this before. But it's really unique. It doesn't look like a standard one. Uh, but it's really easy uh, to install. And I really like that the mounting bracket that they have for it um, basically has, uh, you know, you can put it uh, basically at kind of any angle because you can move this little part down and around and stuff. So you have a lot of different angles. You got genated, <laughs> basically. Uh, and by things, I don't think it's so much that he was lying. He was just kind of pulling a prank. He likes to he likes to pull people's legs. He didn't he didn't mean any harm by it. Also, what's up, Jody? Welcome to the stream. But yeah, so the the, the cool thing about this this model is all you have to do is plug in this solar panel, and then um, once you have the solar panel plugged in, uh, basically you do that, and then. Um, once you connect the camera and stuff to it, uh, all you have to do is connect to Wi-Fi. You can do a wired connection if you want to, but you, I mean, it's not necessary. And I, I honestly think that it's a lot harder to use these if you use a wired connection as opposed to a, a wireless one. And so that's what makes this really, really nice. But the camera is really good. It has a really nice swivel base. It's basically almost 360 degrees. So you can view any different spot from outside and stuff. And that's something that I think is cool for it. Um, but, uh, you know, they, they have really high quality products. And like I said, this one's very unique in its, its design and its solar panel specifically. It's a four megapixel camera. Um, and it has like, like I said, really nice quality, really nice swivel feature or swivel features. And I'm so, I'm really excited to set these up. 
Uh, like I said, I haven't done it yet because I haven't decided like the perfect place that I want to put it. You guys would not believe how many security cameras I have around my house. Like currently, without even installing these three that, that well, I've shown you two, but I'm about to show you the third. Without even installing these, I already have nine security cameras around my household. Like, so I, I can see anything and everything. And like, if a squirrel farts, I'm going to know, you know, exactly where it farted. It's just, it, it's crazy. Um, but we're going to go ahead and move to the last camera that I have to show you guys. And basically, it's very similar to the first one. Um, it's uh, basically, this one is also a wired slash wireless one, and you can decide. But this one does not have a solar panel like the other one was. Um, and so that's why uh, it's a little bit different. And so I'm going to go ahead and open this up and show you guys this one and basically it's pretty much the same just so like as the other as the last one uh just a different color oh you have nine too see evan's nose evan's notes but again another manual as always and then here's the actual camera itself like i said very similar in design except that just this one is white and the other one is black uh but basically i can show you like swivel all the way basically 360 degrees has a uh, microphone and speaker on the back of it so that you can um basically speak through it or hear sound from it let's see nikita i entered the darth vader giveaway if i win i'm gonna gift it to you oh yo this is so awesome oh my i love any anything star wars related please sign me up uh, a worm can't move in my yard without us knowing. Exactly. It'd be like that. Like, I, I, I forgot where I got that. Oh, you know what? I got that analogy from Phineas and Ferb. They're like, if a squirrel farts, I'll know it. And, like, that's that's basically the case uh, for me. So, I, I understand exactly. But, uh, again, this one also comes with a really nice mounting bracket for the camera. Super easy to set up. It's super easy to screw in. I mean, all you have to do is hit these two screws um, and then basically put this at the top. And then it'll uh, swivel under it. Um, there is a cord for it, so you will need a cord wherever you put it. Like I said, if you're going to put this one outside, make sure you have a place to plug it in. Uh, because when you, uh, this one, like I said, like the, the, the model previous to this has a solar panel, so it doesn't need anything but the solar panel. This one actually needs an external power source. And then of course it's got the mounting screws for it. Um, it's got an additional, um, extender for the actual that's what i like about this too uh so this is the power cord but this you can plug into the end of this this right here and then it extends the power cord even more so if you didn't have a spot outside to use this uh you could use it on the um the inside too and run it like under a door through a hole in the house or something um and so that way you could use it outside even if you didn't have a plug outside so that's the one thing that i really enjoy about it but overall um these sets of uh real link cameras are just really fantastic and i'm really excited to install of them all of them seem really nice um and from the reviews that i've read about them and you know basically seen other content creators um they're just really fantastic and so i'm I'm really excited to adding these to my collection of you know what my neighbors probably think i'm crazy because over the past like since we moved in over like the past three months i've like put in smart locks and a bunch of cameras and stuff and like every time i've noticed that every time i come home from like the store or something and they're like because they like sit outside with their friends and stuff and they like talk to each other and basically like as soon as i step outside of my house if i look to the left i can see them and i i they they notice that like every time um every time i walk to the door i like just use my fingerprint to open the door and stuff and so i'm pretty sure they think i'm like pretentious or like snobby or whatever because i have like all these smart all these cameras and all like and i, I basically never uh never go outside so like they're probably thinking that I'm just this shut in who's paranoid or something like that. So I, 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 I've never asked them, but I'm pretty sure that's probably what they're thinking. And, and Nate, I definitely believe you're that neighbor, but yeah, I, I could basically catch them uh, pooping in my yard. If, if that's, if that's what they were doing. <laughs> um, but yeah, real link makes some really, uh, really good security camera stuff. Um, I'm curious to see how their quality competes with Yuffie's because y'all know me, I am a Yuffie fanboy. Um, and so, um, I, I'm, I'm curious to see which one's going to be better. And so, uh, if you guys come back 
Probably, I don't know if I'll have them up tomorrow, because uh, I stream tomorrow too. Uh, I don't know if I'll have them up then, but next week for sure I will have them up. So like, if you guys are curious as to which one I think is better, I'll definitely give you my opinion on that. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm always going to stick with Yuffie because I love Yuffie, but you know, um, just in case, just in case. Um, anyways, next up on our carousel, I sent for anchor too. I, I absolutely understand Nate. I absolutely understand. Um, but, uh, next up that we have on our list is this really awesome, really fantastic, um, uh, dehumidifier. I actually have it behind me. Um, it's this one right here. Um, and I also, I don't know for those of you who haven't been here recently, we have a new dog. Her name is Shiva. And she's an eight-year-old German Shepherd, and she is absolutely precious. Let me see if I can zoom in on it. Uh, uh. Hi, Shiva. Hi, Shiva. She's so cute. I love her. Um, but she is she is a new addition to our home, and so now we have we have three cats and two dogs and it's just it's look my girlfriend of course as soon as i introduce shiva my girlfriend shows up in the chat and she's she's we're just gonna we're gonna have a farm by the end of the year but yeah she is she's such a sweetheart she's just so cute shiva. Shiva. she's so cute and fluffy Birds next? No, I don't want any birds. But uh, let's go ahead and get into this dehumidifier. I'm going to pull this video up real quick. First of the shoppable videos. And basically, I did this one in this room, too. So here we have my air job. Absolutely amazing dehumidifier. And I'm going to basically show you guys how it works and how fantastic it is. So first off, we'll go up to the top here where we can see the panel and everything. So obviously this one gives the power, so if I press that, it's gonna turn it off. If I press it, it'll turn it back on. Uh, right now, I have it set to basement, uh, which it has these preset modes. Continuous will just continuously dehumidify, which you can hear it just came back on. But sleeping area has- Oh wait, first off, how could I forget, guys? That's right, hydrate or dehydrate. My shirt matches my icon. Don't forget that every Dragon Blogger stream hosted by your boy Nikita. You need to have your water bottles with you so that you can stay hydrated. It's very important too. So make sure that you got your water bottles ready and hydrate. Cheers, everyone. It's funny. I've got the little hydrate or dehydrate trifecta. I have it on. Then it's the in the panel right there, like where my picture is. It's also there. And then right below it, it's, it's, the, it's the triple hydrate trifecta. That's how you know it's meant to be. Has a set to 55 humidity, living area is 50, basement is 45. So when you set it to these and the humidity gets set level, it'll turn off. But if you leave it on continuous, it'll just constantly dehumidify regardless of what's going on. Now, you also have a timer that you can set. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn the fan speed down just so it's not as loud. But you have a timer that you can set. And if you hit it, you can cycle between the lowest setting, which is half an hour, or the highest setting, which is 24 hours. And so that's something that I think is really cool because you have the options to scale the time as you see fit. And as I showed you earlier, you have uh, the different fan speeds that you can set. You have a filter button too. And what I like is that you have a mirage button, which if you look at the front of it, you can see there's nothing there. But if I hit the mirage button, boom, it shows you what the humidity level is currently at in the room. And as you can see here, it reflects up here. It's now, this thing is an absolute beast. I have, I've had <clears throat> basically tested a couple of, um, of, uh, dehumidifiers at this point. And this one is an absolute monster powerhouse. Sorry, I'm trying to get my camera. My camera keeps like listing a little bit. I'm trying to get it to where to stop moving. Um, but no, it's an absolute beast of a, of a dehumidifier. Uh, you get a full 70 pints. It comes with, I don't show it in the video, but it comes with a really nice hose for draining it. Um, and this, ba the one that I have is basically good for 4,500 square feet. So it, it is meant for um, large capacity rooms, essentially. 
and it really does work well. Um, it's really good at drying. It, it can even dry clothes. It can dry a damp room after like some flooding maybe. Um, and not only that, but there is a $50 clickable coupon on the page for it as well too. So if you're interested in it, this is definitely one that I recommend. Like I said, it's, it's behind me right here. Um, and I, I use it every so often because the room that I'm in is the most humid, uh, in the house because it, it, the door is not quite sealed all the way. So, you know, it will get the hottest in here, man. Speaking of hot y'all, the RAC went out. What was that? Was that yesterday? Yeah, it was yesterday. It was Sunday and, uh, it got, so it got up to like 83 degrees inside the house, man. I was sweating. My girlfriend was sweating. It was hot. And luckily the, the AC repairman was able to come out the same day and fix the problem. But man, if he hadn't been able to, woo, it would have been bad. It really would have been bad. But speaking of bringing that heat, nothing brings that heat quite like a microwave does. And I know that was a very cheesy transition, but uh, if I don't stop myself, I will just continue to talk about things that are not related to Amazon products for forever. But James is going to be showing us this really cool Toshiba microwave. And I, you know what? <clears throat> like, I always knew Toshiba was a good brand. But I always, whenever I hear Toshiba, I think of, like, computer stuff. And they proved me wrong. This is one of their um, microwave ovens with SmartSense. I just did my first Toshiba product. Um, I did a, uh, a toaster oven. And so I, I submitted that today. So it'll probably be up soon. So it probably one of us is probably going to cover that product soon. But... Man, Toshiba makes some really high quality kitchen accessories, and so James is going to show us this one. James here, and today we're taking a quick look at the new product, guys. This is from Toshiba. This is their new microwave. Now, this is their ML2-EM12EA 1.2 cubic feet microwave. That's actually a nice size, guys. Now, the cool thing is, you guys see this? This is black in color, but black brushed aluminum. Uh, design here so it does not like a stainless steel it's a it almost looks like a black brushed which i like now some cool facts about this guys this has a new built-in smart moisture sensor so it can detect the moisture in the food so it doesn't ruin your food or over dry it out which is really really cool now you have your full keyboard over here or keypad i should say some of these key buttons right here is uh sensor reheat auto cook soft and melt potato rice veggie frozen pizza yes you heard it right you can do a frozen pizza in here finally and frozen entree then you have popcorn one pound defrost clock memory um, professional defrost timer so you can do your own timer and then you have your keypads one through zero but also you have on and off for the beeps so if you guys ever got tired of the beeps when it got done uh, Oh, uh, speaking of the beeps, you know, this is perfect for when you want to go uh, have some midnight snacking and you don't want to wake up the whole house when you heat something up. If you, <laughs> It's one of three situations that's going to happen. If that beep is left on, you're either going to hit it early and your food not going to be cooked all the way, so you got to pop it in a second time. You are a lightning god and you, you always stop it within that area where it's between three and one seconds before the beeping starts. Or you're like me and clumsy and forget that it's even in there and then the beeping goes off and the whole house hears it and then you wake everyone up and they're like, what you making this late? And so if you want people out your microwave business, uh, you can hit the button on this and silence those beeps. Uh, working, you can actually shut that off. You don't have to listen to it again. Then you have your auto 30 second cook time and your echo mode. So it does go into smart echo mode, which drops down like 50% uh, uh, power and it'll just cook from there until it's ready. So that's actually really cool. Now, some of these buttons do multiple functions, which is also great. Now, to set the clock, of course, hit clock right, grab the time and it is, of course, 1228. And we're gonna be clock again. We are done. There's our clock. Clock is now set. Uh, some cool things. Now, some of the buttons, like I said, do multiple things. Like the auto cook can um, cook different types of stuff, uh, including auto cook bacon. Um, it can auto cook frozen rolls or muffins. It can auto cook beverages like coffees, uh, auto cook chicken pieces and oatmeal. And then you have soft milk. Um, the soft and the melt has several uh, styles. They go from one to three sticks, all the way into 
all the way down to three to eight ounces of cream cheese, which is actually really cool to have that option. I just love that you can do that. Now, the so this, like, <clears throat> excuse me. So first off, like I said, like James does a really good job at, at showing you all the settings and how to use the interface for it too. Uh, but it's really cool. Like this, this microwave just has a bunch of bunch of cool features. Um, it's got hands free operation. You can use it with Alexa. Um, and so uh, basically, it allows you to have control of your microwave from your voice assistant, which I think is cool. Um, it has a bunch of preset menus, uh, like James was saying, popular foods like popcorn, potatoes, pizza, vegetables, other other different stuff. And so that's something that adds to it too. It's got a built-in humidity sensor, which uh, basically optimizes your heating and makes cooking easier. And it's got that smart sensor, so it doesn't dry out your food too, which you know a lot of times reheating, especially like food like chicken, you know, like when you reheat it in the microwave, you don't want to dry it out too much. Um, and so that's definitely something they can have. The mute function is another thing that's really cool because like I said, you don't want to wake up people in the middle of the night if you're trying to sneak in some food. Um, and of course, it's got that really cool, nice st stainless steel design and some energy saving features too. Um, so if you're looking to pick up a new microwave, definitely you know check out this one. Like I said, it's really cool that it works with Alexa. And you know, I've never, I, I didn't even know smart microwaves existed until James did this product. And so that's just, that's just something that's that's really cool um, about it. You know, we're moving into the future where you can control anything with the sound of your voice. Sooner or later, you'll be able to be like, Alexa, run me a bath. And then it'll be able to start your tub. Unless that's already, is that already a thing? Is is that a thing? Because cause I live under a rock. So if that was actually a thing, I, I wouldn't know. But it sounds like that, that, that would be cool. Just be like, because cause imagine be like, Alexa, run me a bath. You know, like, I would love that. Um, but um, next up on our list, we have a really nice looking air fryer. This is going to be the 10 Talk 10 in 1 air fryer. I believe Nate covered this one. So I'm going to just jump straight into this one. Yo, what is going on, guys? Nathaniel with Dragon Blogger Tech and Entertainment. And today we're going to be taking a look at this super awesome and top of the line air fryer by Tintalk. I'm not going to lie to you guys, I hadn't heard of Tintalk up until this point, but they sent me this air fryer to do a review on. And honestly, this thing immediately replaced all the other air fryers that I have in my house. It has so many awesome features and a ton of cooking space. You guys can see that right here. I opened up the front lid. You got this nice light and chrome finish on the inside. Holy, that looks so clean. I've never seen the inside of an air fryer. It just looks so clean. Side with 16 quarts of cooking capacity, which is absolutely crazy. This whole machine is wrapped in this beautiful stainless steel that I think would look good in any kitchen. And this has a ton of temperature settings. You guys can see right here, I am able to scroll this all the way up to 480 degrees Fahrenheit, which is crazy. And then back down to 120 which is awesome then you're also able to increment this from 10 minute cooking time all the way up to 720 minutes which is insane to me then you guys are also going to notice that on the front panel you're able to select which heating elements you have so if you only want something to cook from the bottom or the top or if you want it to cook at the bottom and the top you hey yo welcome back by things have that option right there as you guys can see but if you don't want to set the temperatures and the time manually you have a ton of presets built in right here that you can just easily select you can select fries you guys can see there it selected 430 degrees fahrenheit and 20 minutes for cooking time you're able to select chicken and then you're also able to have a rotisserie it also has a ton of accessories. You guys can see right there, you get that nice little basket. You're going to get this little rack right here, which is just a very nice chrome finish and very well made, I might add. And then you guys can also see that you're going to get this cute little cooking mitt, which is honestly just really nice. It has that little rubber. I bet that's Nate's favorite part of that product. Soul to protect you. He loved his little fancy little nice cooking mitts. And then you're going to get a really awesome and informative it's so that he can grab hot potatoes straight out of the oven and take a bite out of them. Air fryer cookbook. You guys can see that it has a ton of recipes, stuff that I honestly never thought you could do in an air fryer. And you're going to get these all metal tongs, which feel really well made. That's going to help getting some of that hot food or some of those trays out of the air fryer. Continuing on, you're going to get this grabbing hook to take out some of those trays as well, just so you don't burn yourself. And we are not done yet, my friends. You guys can see that right here. You're going to get these two little prongs because this does have a rotisserie built in. So you're able to use this with your hams, turkeys, or chickens. And then my favorite thing by far is this. 
Oh, never mind. I was wrong. This is his favorite thing. My apologies. Grilling tray. You guys can see that right here. It has this really awesome sear pattern on it. So you're going to be able to cook some steak, some chicken, and just get a really nice grill effect with this Tintock air fryer. But by far, like I said before, my favorite feature is the rotisserie. You guys can see here. Of course he puts potatoes in there. Let's go, Tater Nate. Here, I'm cooking a ton of tater tots all at once, way more than I would be able to with any other air fryer I've ever used. This thing is jam-packed full of features. It works super well. It operates very quietly. So if you guys have been looking for a new top-of-the-line air fryer rotisserie combo, definitely check this one out from Tintalk, and I'll see you on the next one. So as he said, uh, you know, definitely a high quality, high tier, um, amazing air fryer. It's cool that it's got that 10 in one. Um, basically it's an air fryer toaster oven combo. And I really like the rotisserie feature that it has. It's got a really nice, uh, pro grade stainless steel interior. As you can see, it had that nice chrome finish for it too. Um, a one touch start integration of taste and health. So, you know, that you're getting, um, you know that that really cool the, the the coolest feature well one of the coolest features about air fryers is that without oil you basically um use it's it's like 85 for something like 85 percent less fat than regular food so um you know you you've got you've got great taste and and it's healthier it's a healthier option um it cooks about 30 percent faster than your typical um standard air fryer like i said i've never seen an air fryer that look quite like that um and it's really nice that you can use it uh definitely expensive but it's definitely premium as as nate just said just really cool features really nice interface really great finish and just um you know i've never i had never heard of ten talk either until i saw this video that nate did and uh i can tell that they make some really good really nice high quality stuff and it's definitely worth checking out if you're you're interested um in, in you know having something have a, having a top of the line air fryer slash toaster oven slash 10 in one combo basically um for your kitchen now next up on the carousel for this evening we have a really really cool uh tea kettle that i basically had um <clears throat> and it's a by deem one and uh this thing is amazing because and i mean you're gonna see in the video but it's basically got four preset settings for the different type of tea uh black black tea oolong green tea white tea or white tea green tea in some of that order and then it has a fifth setting to just boil water um and so uh basically uh you know it's just a, it's a really nice uh kettle for doing all sorts of things and it just has those um optimal temperatures um to use uh for the different type of tea it's using is she moving i i didn't pay attention oh yeah she is knocked out her name is Shiva. She's a precious German shepherd. Let me see if I can. She knocked out though. She sleep sleep. She come in here and chill with me. You know, it's funny because I try to get Obi to chill in here with me and Obi will leave me after a while. But she will just sit here um, and just just chill with me throughout the entire day and just sleep and listen to me yell, yell and rage at video games. It's quite cute. So this is my by Dean kettle and I am absolutely amazing to use this kettle as a tea maker. Um, that's what it's marketed as. So of course I've put <laughs> some nice uh, tea in there. I have this really good jasmine tea that I've been looking forward to using. And so I've preloaded my little thingy here with some tea. Uh, it's really easy to use uh, this part. You just got to whatever this line is lined up with. That's how you know um, what the position of the container is so right now it's closed i'm going to go ahead and switch it over to open just so i can show you that it's loaded with tea already and then when i want to put it back on i just line this this little line up with the open and push it down hold on i gotta make sure it's settled properly we'll go ahead and line those up and then turn it to close and then i'm good to go now if you look here at the tea maker itself it has a really nice panel here that basically tells you what you can do. So um, you can just boil water as a kettle. You can set it for black and herbal tea, oolong tea, white tea, and green tea. So this, this is jasmine, which is a green tea. And so that's what I'm going to set it on. Uh, so let me just zoom back out here real quick and just go. And like I said, one of the coolest parts about this kettle is that it has those temperatures that are unique to the type of tea. It's like the optimum temperature for uh, brewing that tea. So, you know, depending on what tea you have, that's the button that you're going to want to press. Go ahead and place this in here. 
And as you can see, it also has like a little filter here too for when you're pouring so that if for some reason there is something else in there, it doesn't come out. But we've just got water and some good tea. So I'm gonna go ahead and place this on, press it down and make sure that the top is secured. And it is. And then I'm gonna go ahead and hit the green tea button and then it's gonna get started. And so I will basically bring it back once it's done and show you guys the finished result. So the tea just finished brewing and it made a beep sound. And now you can see that this button is flashing. But as you can see here, the tea is done. It looks amazing. I'm so ready to pour myself a glass. In fact, I'm gonna go reach up here and grab me a teacup because I'm going to enjoy this. But if you're looking for a very amazing and fast brewing system for your tea, definitely check out this by Dean Kettle. It took maybe about four minutes to get to where we are. And I've got some amazing tea ready to go. So yeah, absolutely fantastic tea kettle. I haven't had one like it with all of those different preset settings where you can just simply boil water, have the optimized temperature for tea, so it makes it unique. Uh, but it does get really, it, it, it boils the water really fast, gets your tea ready really quickly. Um, <clears throat> and that's something that I really appreciate about it. So, I mean, if you're looking for a high class kettle, this is this is my favorite one so far. I love this one more than my Kosori one that I, I used to have, that I used to use, I use that one religiously. I use this one religiously too, so it's just a really nice one to have. Now next up, uh, on our on our little carousel, we have this really cool uh, Siago standing desk that I am a big big fan of. My girlfriend uses it. It's currently thirty one percent off too. Uh, so if you're looking for a really nice ergonomic desk, uh, pay attention because you might like this one. Typically, it's like three hundred and sixty dollars. Right now, you can get it for about two fifty. Uh, so it's definitely worth looking at. Uh, was super easy to build. I'd recommend having two people. You don't need two people, but it expedites the price process quite a bit. But it's just, I, I promise you, you'll see how cool this thing is. Hey, everybody. So this bad boy right here is my Siago Electric Height Adjustable Standing Desk, and it's absolutely amazing. It has a lot of cool features. The first of which is the feature that you use to adjust, adjust the actual height of the standing desk, which I'm going to show you here. So I already have some custom profiles built in, where if I hit one right here, it's going to adjust it to its highest position. Now, its lowest height is 23.6 inches, and it goes all the way up to about... 49.2 inches and it will hold 240 pounds of weight. It's absolutely sturdy and super easy to build. It only took me about 20 minutes to build this entire thing. But now that it's about to reach its highest height, it's going to stop right there. I'm going to hit two and it's going to just down to a sort of medium setting at 100. And then uh, once it gets there, I'm going to show you guys basically how to program this really amazing, really easy to use standing desk. So I'm gonna go over here to the little panel and as you can see, it's at 100 and it has these two buttons on the side to adjust the height and then four buttons on the side that you use to save the profiles so I'm going to demonstrate that here so right now it's at hundred which is basically my second setting so I'm gonna lower this down right here just by holding this button and then letting go right when I get to where I want so it's going to be 89 then I'm going to hit the S button hit the 3 button and that's going to save it to profile 3 so now that I want to hit 2 it's gonna go back up to the hundred that I had previously set it for and now when I hit the three, it's going to go to the new pro profile that I just set up, which it should be 89. So we're going to see that here. So overall, this desk is absolutely fantastic, absolutely easy to use. It has two clips on the side that you can use for headphones and all sorts of things. So if you're looking for an awesome ergonomic office desk, this is definitely the one to pick out. It's absolutely fantastic, super easy to build, and I don't know what I would do without it. This thing is absolutely fantastic and amazing. I felt the entire time uh, I was recording that and every time I have to watch that video, I feel like I am the world's greatest adjustable standing desk salesman because I was talking so fast. Like I knew everything. You know what? The thing is, I, I, I sound excited in that video because I really was excited about the product. It was the first standing desk um, that I've ever done and the first standing desk I've ever had. Um, and I have always, I'd always wanted one. And so when Justin was like, Hey, do you want to review this, this standing desk? And I was like, yeah, I do for sure. Um, and so I was super excited about it. And that was something that that was really cool, um, to do. And so, um, it, like I said, it took about 20 minutes to build. It's, it's really easy, um, really high quality, um, 
and it's it's very spacious too um you know and so um like i said if you're looking for a a really cool ergonomic standing desk an alternative to uh sitting sedentarily uh throughout your workday especially if you if you work from home this is definitely going to be something that you want to check out now speaking of work from home uh, if you're doing certain kind of video conferences and stuff, uh, this next product that Nate covers is going to be one that you might want to pick up. Uh, it's a it's a pretty expensive uh, <laughs> device, but for the all the cool features and stuff that you get out of it, I would say that it's 100% worth it. It's a nice 1080p, 360 degree webcam um, that does all sorts of things. Uh, it's called the Emi e-meet meeting capsule um nate did an amazing job at showing all the features it was just something that that was really cool um and i've never seen anything like this before it's also got a remote that comes with it and like i said it is kind of kind of chunky it's a, it's a, it's quite the the price but there is a hundred dollar clickable coupon on the page for it too um so without further ado we'll go ahead and jump into this one Hey, what is going on guys? Nathaniel with Dragon Blogger Tech and Entertainment. And today we're going to be taking a look at this awesome meeting capsule from a company called Emi. Now this thing is super awesome and has a ton of awesome features built into it. It has a red dot design award nomination and it won in 2021. It has a bunch of different modes built into it. But let's go ahead and jump in and see everything that this comes with. And then we will test this out. In I'm going to jump straight to the test, though, just so we can see some of the features that cool was it. Hey, it's Gamer Grandma! What's up, Gamer Grandma? How you doing, Miss Sheila? Welcome to the stream. We're not using the mic in this video. You have anti-flicker options here. You have zoom options. Right now, we are in classic mode. So as you guys can see here, excuse my dirty room, but we have a pretty wide view. Um, we can switch to other modes right here so we can go... See, no wonder Nate calls my room dirty because I don't think that his room is dirty. And like, I don't think that mine is either, but he always calls my room dirty. I guess it's just because I have a lot of stuff. Spotlight mode where shit was. You're sleepy. Uh, you know what? I, I understand that too. I took a, I took a fat nap before today's stream. And so I'm not groggy. I had like some hot chocolate and a, and a Coke Zero before stream. Um, so I'm, I'm still a little groggy. I'm probably going to go to go to sleep early tonight. I'm a little bit sleepy, but, um, you know, I know you're sleepy, but thank you for being here. Regardless, we really do appreciate you coming by. We'll zoom in on one person that is speaking. Now, continuing on, this is in private mode. Now, all of these modes are controllable through the remote, so you don't have to use the software to do this. But as you can see here, the in private mode is basically... See, now I will say my room is not quite where I want it to be. And that's kind of why I have stuff kind of like loosely hanging because I know I'm about to change everything. Like, I can't wait to like, you know, get into like... Um uh the in game for my room um also sheila i'm glad you stopped in to say hi um but i'm getting it like a ethernet extender so that i can move my computer from where it is right here to over here where my other thing is because what's cool is um i i want to have my my like lightsaber wall because i'm gonna put some more lightsabers here i think i got like four more that i can add to this wall and it's gonna be behind me during my stream so that when i op turn on my stream i can have the lightsabers on so it'll look really cool so that's what that's why i haven't like settled everything just yet but yeah i know where everything is you can ask me where where anything specific is and i could definitely tell you but yeah i'm super excited because i i'm gonna love having the lightsaber wall behind me while i'm doing streams it'll look really cool um, so that's kind of why like everything's kind of like strewn about because I know I'm about to like I, I probably I'm waiting on Nate to send me the lightsaber hooks so I can put the stuff on my wall. Um, but once I get that, um, I'll be able to transition everything over. I just don't want to, you know, move everything and, and have it not finished first. Uh, because doing the stuff on the wall is going to be the hardest part. And then I, I've i also got to put what the wall where my computer is right now. I'm also going to put stuff on be that just wall turning too. On um, oops, sorry. Um, so like all of the, the wall that's going to be behind me is all the FX lightsabers, like all the lightsabers from the actual, like Star Wars canon, like all the Disney, the Disney and the old school movies. That's what that back wall is going to be. And then all the sabers that are my custom ones that I got made for me personally are going to be on the wall where my computer is right now. So um, the camera will be able to see both of them, kind of like how you can see the wall behind me and the wall over there. That's kind of how it's going to be. You'll be able to see um, 
the lights, both lightsaber walls, essentially. So I've got it. It's going to look really cool once I get it finished. And, and I'm excited to show you guys once it is finished. Off the camera and the microphone for complete discretion with your conversations. Now we move to collaboration mode. So what this is going to do is basically allow the camera to focus in on multiple people at the same time. Now I am only. Yeah, Sheila, I'm excited too. Um, I say, give me about like, give me, so my birthday is in like two weeks. Give me like a week or two after my birthday. And I promise you, I'll have things set up just how I want them to. One person speaking, but what I'll do is I'll go ahead and turn this. And so when I start speaking here, what you're going to notice is it's going to pull me into a frame. Now, if there was another person talking, it would automatically pull that in. And it's trying to actually pull in multiple people here because it's seeing my screen. So we'll go ahead and rotate this. I uh, don't say that gamer grandma. That's not true. You've got, you've got, you're like, you've got at least like another 75 years. Don't worry. You'll, you'll be good. You'll be good. You can make it two weeks. Uh, but as you can see, um, Nate did an amazing job uh, doing this really cool video conference camera. It's got a lot of cool features. I love the collaboration mode and stuff where you can have different people talking. And it gives you like that, that I forget, I don't know the, the name of the style, but like they do it in movies a lot where one person is talking and then while they're talking, it shows another person. It brings the screen into the side and the third person will start talking. So to bring in another screen from the other side, it does that really cool effect. And it, you, you understand why this little video video conference thing is this basically $800 uh but you get $100 off right now and then a $100 clickable coupon on the page too so you can save quite a, a big chunk you know but it is going to be quite a big hefty big boy buy um it's 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 fantastic um I still I love my obs bot uh anything that has those AI tracking uh you know prowesses in the camera is just kind of cool um this one is way more expensive than an OBSBOT. Uh, but if you wanted something similar, that's definitely a lot cheaper. Uh, the OBSBOT cameras are 4K quality. Uh, that's only a 1080p. So OBSBOT, you get 4K. Um, it still has those tracking features. It doesn't have all the same tracking features, uh, but it's about a third of the price. So if you're interested in that one, you might be interested in the OBSBOT also. So it's definitely worth checking out. Oh, you want the OBSBOT me? Okay. Okay. See, I have the, um, the OBSBOT 4K AI tracker i don't know what it's actually i have it on top of my computer i forget what this it's it's this one if i can get it and it's it's pretty nice i i like it because it, it's really cool it follows me around the room and stuff um it's fantastic um and i, I just i love obsbot i this was this is the second one i had their 1080p one first and then i also had their um their 4k one so it's just really cool um, moving on to our next product though. Sorry, I'd be running my mouth. I'm so sorry. I will talk to y'all about anything all day. Uh, we have this really cool evaporative cooler that Justin covers. And for those of you who are unfamiliar with evaporative cooler, basically if you're in a dry climate or in dry temperatures or whatever, um, and you want a little bit more humidity in the air while you're trying to cool off, uh, basically this thing does that. It not only cools the air, but it also adds water to the, the air around you. And so, um, Justin is going to show us what this evaporative cooler basically does and why why it's so amazing. Also, he he always talks about how he lives in Southern California, and I always think about that that song. It never rains in Southern California, and I just think like, well, it makes sense now. That's why it's so dry. So he needs an evaporative cooler. Also, Timothy Lombardi, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Dragon Blogger Tech and Entertainment family. We are happy to have you here, and thank you so much for the follow once again. I'm here showcasing this Air Choice evaporative, evaporative Cooler Tower Fan. What you get here is your typical tower fan, except you can pour water and ice, as well as an ice pack with it, to help cool down and blow a really, really cool breeze, which dramatically cools down the air. This is ideal if you live in dry, hot climates, not in hu super humid climates, of course, but if you live in the Southwest, this is ideal. So you get the water fill container up at the top, but you could see it drains through all the way to the bottom and you could fill it in at the bottom as well. So you could choose to pour it in at the top to fill it, or you could pour it directly in at the bottom. Adding the little ice cooler, and it comes with one that you put in the freezer, you fill it with water, and then you place it in the bottom. You can see the coils back here, easy to clean. There's a nice little filter on it. Here is the bottom container. Here is where you would add your ice pack to make Pumpkin always in the video with his daddy. Also, what's up, Gizmo? Welcome to the stream. Make it nice and cold so that you get a cool mist and it cools down the air that's blowing on you. And it makes just a dramatic 
difference. Living here in Southern California or... Also, do you prefer going by Gizmo or Carol? The reason why I say Gizmo is because when I was growing up, we used to have a cat and his name was Gizmo. He was a he was a gray Siamese. Um, and so like I every time I see Gizmo, I just think about uh, Gizmo, my cat. So that's why I, I just call you Gizmo off the I like out the gate. But if you prefer to be called something else, please let me know. I apologize. Um, if otherwise, uh, just just let me know. You know, we used to live in Arizona, having the ability to just put an ice cold water will really help because we have a very low humidity level. So the water vapor and the cold water vapor that's being blown by the fan really makes a difference. And it's better than an air conditioner because it doesn't use as much power. Now, obviously, like I said, if you're in a very high humid area, you, uh, evaporative coolers don't work typically. Oh, your mom had a dog named, named Gizmo? Does everyone have a pet named Gizmo? <laughs> as well, but they work very well if you live in a dry climate area. So as he's saying, like those evaporative coolers are really cool. Um... If they're if basically you're in a dry um, climate, you need some extra moisture in the air. It's really good for keeping you cool, and it it oscillates. Um, and so you know you can whatever room you put in, especially if you're in a dry climate, you know it's going to be cooled. It's going to be a little bit more damp in there too, which helps with the cooling, and it's just absolutely amazing. Uh, let's see. I think it's a reference to those cute little things. What are they? Cute little thing gizmo gizmos and gadgets or whatever. Oh, Gremlins. Oh, see, okay, so what's funny is, and before I get on to the next product, I'm going to tell you all a little story. So outside of Shiva, because we got Shiva from my sister's girlfriend who wanted, um, you know, like to rehome Shiva because, you know, uh, for certain reasons. And so we decided to, you know, we were like, we'll take Shiva because, you know, she's she's so sweet and such a sweetheart. But all of our own pets, the ones that, like, we adopted because all of the other, all, the other four pets were all adopted from um, the Humane Society. And so they all have sci-fi names, which I think is, is kind of cool. Like all of our pets kind of have sci-fi names. And so her first two cats, uh, Mulder and Scully, uh, which are from the X-Files, um, if you guys know that. And then my dog, who I got, his name is Obi-Wan, but I just call him Obi because, you know, I'm a big Star Wars fan. And then um, the last cat that we got back in May, his name is Jonesy after the cat from Alien. So they all have sci-fi names which i think is really cool it, it always makes me happy when i get to tell that story to people all right moving on to the next product james is going to be covering this really cool um dash cam which you know uh for those of you who have vehicles and, and want a dash cam i definitely recommend uh getting one um you know they can they can run anywhere this one's a little bit on the higher end because it's a 4k dual dash cam but there are ones that are more affordable uh you know depending on your price range um so um just depending on on what your budget is but this is definitely a really good one james, here, um and james is going to does he show us footage in this video okay this isn't one where he shows us footage so i'm going to skip where he shows after the unboxing what the actual camera and stuff looks like in your bracket but you need those four metal prongs to make the uh, gps work you also have your usb port and you have uh avn so the avn is going to be for your rear facing camera and while he's talking about this one real quick, I'm going to just run to the restroom real quick. Typically, I, I go about halfway through the stream. So uh, my apologies for the small delay, but I will be right back. On the back is your three-inch screen, touch screen. If you guys really want, it tells you how to work it. It says, press red. P please read the uh, manual before using. Please do all these, you know, whatever. On the side is your power button and your micro SD card slot. Make sure this SD card, they suggest a Samsung Class 10 U Ultra uh, card for this to make it work properly. Now I'm going to set that aside and inside is the rest of the kit and we have the manual. Right here is, I believe this is like a screen protector or something. I'm not really sure what this plastic piece is, but you have a couple of them so... The manual, I'm sure, will tell you. Here's the full user manual, guys, if you really need it. Indicators, right? Stuff like that. Very simple, very easy. Tells you how to hook it up, how to install it, everything in the kit, including 3M adhesive, and those two things are electric, electric static stick. Oh, you got the name Gizmo from the Gremlins. Okay, see, it's been so long since I seen the Gremlins, I can't even remember what. I, I'm be, I'm not even gonna gonna lie to you. I, I don't remember that movie. I need to go back and watch it. Um, 
But yeah, no, this is a fantastic option for, for people using the camera. I'm going to skip just a little bit. Um, I wish he showed a video test for it. Most cars are going to fit that. Very simple, very easy. You have your body panel trim tool. So yeah, there's not much more about it. He's just showing you basically all the stuff that comes with it to set it up. And it's basically pretty straightforward on how to set it up. And then, of course, it's powered from within the car. So as long as you're not using your... Um, your little uh, lighter charger, uh, your car lighter charger for anything, you should be good to go. Um, and of course, you can always have adapters for your lighter chargers to use if you need to like a USB plug in for it too. But it's just a very high quality 4K dual dash cam that has built in Wi-Fi for it too, so that you can use it to connect to your phone and always get that footage right to your phone so you can take screenshots and do all sorts of things, record it. Um, it supports a maximum of 256 gigabyte memory card for it. Um, there's a $20 uh, clickable coupon on the page too uh but basically it's got really cool built-in wi-fi and gps so not only do you get that really nice quality video with the recording options for it too but it will also tell you where you were when it does it and i think that that is something that is absolutely amazing let's see uh look up sing to what what oh, oh let me read the uh, the cue sing to has a lemur i think and bondage straps and big yellow eyes reminds me of that look up sing to what do you let me hold on let me copy and paste this real quick so i don't forget because sometimes i do be forgetting to look up stuff but if i put it in my notepad then i won't forget so i've got that saved so i can do that also what's up Brawlio? welcome to the stream happy to have you here buddy how you doing um james also covers this next product that um is basically another straightforward product it's a basically a a, 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 a non-contact thermometer which comes in handy i got mine like right a little justin had me one sent to me like a little bit after the COVID outbreak um and so uh you know these are really you know really nice um you know when you just want to check the temperature especially if you have kids you know you can just check it and check their temperature um and move on um oh you're working bro leo you're always working when you're doing stream but thank you for stopping by even though i i know i know work uh can be time consuming and stuff but we appreciate you stopping by um and uh computer pal incorporated uh welcome to the stream happy to have you here uh ears covered and ready roll the video <laughs> we gotta stop making fun of james so much he's gonna get mad at us one day <laughs> james here today we're taking a quick look at a new product guys Hey, quick look, and the video is under two minutes. I'm proud of this. I'm so, I am so proud of James. Like, granted, some of his videos are still long, but he's gotten so much better about not making 10 minute videos. From El Pal, this is their non contact infrared body thermometer. Now, guys, this is a two in one. You can do body or surface temperature checks. Inside this, guys, you get the thermometer itself and two AAA batteries. The AAA batteries, guys, will go on the bottom right here, just like this. Put it down. You put the plus minus in there, slide it back, you're good to go. Now it has a little heart symbol right there, which is kind of cool. I like that little logo. You have a trigger. That trigger is what's going to turn it on on the back right there. And you guys can see the scene screen. Now it is still covered by the protective film. So I'm going to pull that off. If you guys need, there are instructions. On the side, you have mode, memory, and you have set. The set will let you set your... I like his videos too, Boston Butterfly. Uh, you know, you, James, uh, <laughs> you, you exactly like Ed said. We we just make fun of him because we love him. He his videos are great. He and, and I promise you, no one knows more about the products that they get than James does because he really he any any question you have, especially if it's a product about like lighting and sound, uh, because he like he's an audiophile. Um, he can give you all sorts of kind of in-depth answers, but we, we have to tease him. It's just like programmed into our system at this point. <laughs> You'll sound on and off. Uh, right here, memory will let... Oh, have you seen him? Uh, has he, have you seen, have you caught him with one of his Tillamook pepperoni sticks? <laughs> you do person one and two, and mode will allow you to change it from body to surface. And hopefully you guys can kind of see this. So now we are now on surface. I'm gonna point it at something just like that. There's your surface temperature of a surface temp. Now I'm going to switch it over. There's your surface temperature of a surface temp. Thank you, James. <laughs> over here into body. Now you guys will see it says body, right? Now let's click it right at my forehead. You guys will see that my temperature is now 97.7, but let's do it again over here. 
97.8, right? So very accurate, very good. Now I am. So like very simple, very easy to use. I, it's just, it's the simple between uh, changing between surface and body, just pointing it to where you want to go. Make sure you're not touching it, hit the button. And then after about a second, second and a half, uh, you're good to go. Uh, so just a really straightforward thermometer, really nice price. These are really handy to have. I recommend everyone should have at least one of these in their home, honestly, uh, just depending on like if you have guests, if you have children, if your children have friends come over, you know, so on and so forth, especially with like um, COVID still kind of going around and like... Um, um, monkey pox on the rise now too. Maybe we just can't, we can't get a break. Can we? Uh, yes. And it is an infrared, uh, temperature thing. It, it's really nice. I have one. Mine's is white. I wish I would have brought mine in here, but it's not the same brand, but it's just, it's super easy to use. You just change the mode to whatever it is, whether you want a surface temperature check in and, or you change it to body and you just hold it. Yeah. I hope mine about this far away from my forehead or so about an inch, you know, you can get a little closer. The closer you are, the more accurate. You just, it's, it's more, um, what's the word sanitary to you know not touch the surface uh so you don't get you know contaminated or anything um yeah if you set it to surface you could point it at the temperature heat rises yep and cold air sinks uh this next product is something that i, I love getting to show i got to do it last week too so i'm super excited to get to do it today um and so um let me adjust my camera so this is the geiker super slide hold on let me get my camera set up so it doesn't tilt there we go so this is the geiker super slide now what's cool about this thing is uh it's got a lot of cool features it has over 500 levels uh to use for it which basically um provides you with endless hours of enjoyment now i like this thing a lot because um you know, whether you're traveling a lot on an airplane, in a car, um, you can use it. Me and my girlfriend are going back and forth on levels. Uh, I've cycled through the whole thing once. So now I'm just doing it. I, the only time I play it anymore really is when I show it on stream. Um, but what's really cool is it comes with these little pieces that you fit in. Now you don't have to worry about these like demagnetizing credit cards or anything. They're, they're not like magnets, uh, like traditional magnets. So like I could put them on my phone and stuff and I wouldn't have to worry about it. Like, de like messing up my screen or my credit cards or anything. Uh, but they only stick to this surface here. And even though they stick to the surface, like if I hold it upside down, it won't find, but if I shake it a little bit, you see like they'll basically for the most part fall out. Um, and so the goal is to get this red square to the center. All oh, right, Ed, you won one on stream, right? Um, the goal is to get the red thing to the center, but once you turn it on, it'll basically show you what level you're on and the orientation that, so right now I'm on uh, level 33 and it's going to show you where it wants you to put all the spot, all the blocks and stuff. Uh, and so basically once you get all the blocks in the, um, order that it, it says, uh, you basically hit the red button and then you're good to go. So I'm going to set this one up. I'm going to do a level for you guys. Um, I basically kind of show you how it works. And so you just want to make sure that you match the colors on here. Okay, nice. Awesome, Ed. Yeah, I, I, I remember um, that. I don't know if that was my stream that you... Was it on my stream that you won that one on? I think it might have been. Um, but yeah, once you have the level locked in, you just tap this button and now you're good to go. So like I said, your goal is to get this red block here right in the center at the bottom. So that's what I'm going to do. Boom. And I did it. I have, um, 
I have gotten fairly good at this game uh, just from playing all through through all the levels once. And like I said, when you're done, you just simply hold this button and it cuts off. Um, it also, just to let you guys know, this is like not rechargeable. It is uh, battery powered. You need two double A's for it. And then basically you're good to go. Uh, but this thing is, is perfect for, um, you know, like if you're traveling, uh, if you're going to be on an airplane, if you have like a, if you just want like a really nice little game to play at home, uh, it's just a, a little fantastic option to have. I love this thing. I love sitting there and I love uh, brain teasers. That was level 39. Uh, so I just hit 40. I've cycled through all the levels at least once. Um, and so, um, you know, uh, I've, I, I don't, like I said, I don't play it as much as I used to. Um, especially since I, you know, I sat there one day for like six days straight and I played it for like four hours a day. And I, I went through all the levels cause I was just like, so, uh, just i was i was so enthralled by the game it was just really fun so if you're looking for a really cool option geiker did an amazing job with that game and it just provides such great fun um they also did an amazing job with their um the next game that i'm going to show you which justin uh did um and he plays it with oliver from time to time but it his game is called smart four and it's kind of like connect four but 3d essentially where you go you can go up um and so it's just really cool yeah i i was pretty devoted i was dedicated to finishing it cause i was like i gotta beat all the levels they get man let me tell you something ed once you hit so like you're at 25 and basically until you get to like i want to say like 70 ish like it, you're it, it's pretty like i don't want to say it's like easy but like you know you can get you can get through them probably like without spending more than like 10 minutes on each puzzle but after you pass 70 man it gets so hard ed if you ever get there please let me know it just just it, it jumps up so fast like once you put in that that um the fourth uh the fourth blue piece oh man it gets so hard but it's it's so much fun uh, this is the next Geiker product, though. This is the one that Justin covered, and this is the Smart 4. It's pretty cool. I'm here unboxing the Geeker Smart 4 Connected Smart 3D board game. The best way to describe this is kind of like uh, the Connect 4 board game, except in three dimensions. And instead of red and black, you have black and white pieces. So let's show you what you get in the box. First, you get all the little pieces, both black side and white side. You get the USB-C to charge it, which is nice that you don't put batteries in it. And you get the board itself. And you see the board has little feet on it. They're, oh, they're rubberized, so it doesn't, it doesn't slide at all. Stays put, stays steady. And where's the USB? Which is going to be really important, too, because this thing, they stack on top of each other, so it's really important. But they're kind of magnetic, too. Like, this one actually does have magnetic pieces, and so... Um, you know, that's 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 really important for this one to not slide. I'm gonna skip to where he kind of shows you where he's playing it. Did I have enough battery? Okay, press on it. Now it wants to go. So where's it going? It's going there. So like it actually has like a, a computer in it that calculates where you press and like this is a one you can have this as a one player game that like you can play against another person but you can also play against the onboard computer which I think is really cool. It's I think it's blinking to tell me where its move is. So you press down to acknowledge its turn. So now we'll do my turn and I'll do here. And now it wants to go here. So let's do that. Then we'll do my turn. And I'll go three up here. Where does it want to go now? See, its turn wants to go in the same spot, so it wants to block me. So we'll do that. So my turn, we're going to go here to not let it get connect for. Now he wants to go here. So we'll play him over here. And then where am I going to go next? I'm going to go here. And he wants to go here. Oh, he's got me in a bad spot here. Because now he can go here to win or here to win, and I have no ability to block him, so I just lost to the easy mode. All right, and that <laughs> would complete. I just lost easy. <laughs> so as you can see, it's really fun. It's basically 
like a sort of connect four um except it can you know it's it's like kind of like connect four meets tic-tac-toe essentially and then you can go like instead of just going on the x and the y axis the X and the Y axis, you also have like a Z axis to come out. Um, and it's just so, it's, it's, it's like a really cool game. Like I love, I, I don't know if it's Geiker or Geeker. I call him Geiker. He said Geeker, but regardless, they make really cool games that are just amazing um, for like brain teasing, you know? And that's something that I really like about them because you get so much value out of, out of them um and it's just it's just they're just a really a really amazing company that does an amazing job at making ama i know i've been saying amazing a lot but really no it's a lot of fun brain teaser games that i definitely um enjoy and it's something that um i feel like a lot of people would enjoy if you if especially if you like the the sort of puzzles and stuff um you know like if you're if you're into puzzles and i guarantee you you will love geiger products because they're just fantastic um next up we have a kind of a big boy product this is going to be the we max vogue pro uh which is um a really awesome projector um i really like uh we max projectors because they come with uh an amazon sister or not amazon sorry an android uh os so you can basically if you're not projecting something specifically you can stream from them because they're able to connect to wi-fi or be wired and basically stream from those services james here with a quick showcase of skip and one thing that I, so he's going to be showing us, um, he's going to be playing Breath of the Wild, I believe. And one thing that I always try to uh, recommend people, or not recommend people rather, but uh, tell people uh, about these, uh, about anything that we do that deals with video and audio quality, is that you're not going to get a firsthand experience like the Dragon Blogger is. So it's really important to listen to what the Dragon Blogger is saying about specific products. So uh, just make sure you listen to what James has to say about the quality. But I, I'm probably like I'm sure that you know these things are, are just fantastic because um, you know they're just they're just really good projectors. I love WeMax projectors. We have the Master Sword. We're going to grab the Royal Broadsword, right? I did not want to fall down, but since we're down here, whatever. As you see, the game plays smooth on here. It looks great. I have no problems with this. We have some wolves here, right? No, not the wolfies. We will take the raw meat. That is why we have the sword off. As you guys see, I just died. That is my bad. He got deaded, <laughs> but no, as you can see, a very high quality, uh, very nice um, projector to have, uh, especially if you like want to host uh, movie nights. It can upscale to 8K, but it supports 4K. Um, it has about 1600 lumens, uh, HDR10, and of course, like I said, it's a smart projector, uh, so it has an Android operating system on there that you can use uh, to stream some of your favorite apps and stuff, and that's something that i just think is really cool um you know because it comes with all that stuff already built in it's basically like having a little portable tv uh that you can use for if you're like hosting parties and stuff um and just just a really fantastic thing to have uh so that is the we max vogue now next up we have these really cool neck fans um that justin is going to be covering and the thing is um, I love neck fans because in the hot Texas heat, these things come in handy and you just put it around your neck, strap it on, you got a nice breeze. And so Justin is going to show these. I really love the red color of these. They're kind of fantastic. Now this is really unique. This is a neck fan. These are all the rage nowadays. I don't know if you, um, if you've ever heard of or had a neck fan, but these are starting to become super popular ways to wear. If you're like at a sports stadium or you're at a sporting event in the heat, you're outside for long periods of time, or maybe you're going for a walk or an extended hike. These are ways you can 
create a air circulation motion. And these are really good at cooling you down because they are right near your neck and where the cool air actually has the best effect of cooling you down. So this is totally flexible. Look at this, totally flexible, amazingly flexible, how much you can flex this air fan. It is three different speeds and you only press the power button between the various speeds, right? You charge this via micro USB, you press the button once to turn it on, which is low mode, then medium, then high, then off. Easy to use. Just wrap it around your neck and turn it on. Now I'm gonna turn on low and you can, again, completely foldable. You could fold it or adjust it however you want to. For the, now it's blowing up in my ears a little bit. Now it's blowing on my neck. Totally adjustable. Now it's on medium. Now it's on high. Lot of airflow, lot of airflow. Here, here's how it sounds, here. Not that loud. Not that loud, considering how much airflow it puts right up in your face, it's not that loud at all. That's pretty neat, actually. I can see myself using this and going for a walk with the dog uh, in the summer when it's a little warmer. And then, yeah, you want to open your headset, my aftershocks. Yeah, pretty cool. And you can make it tighter. If you, if you like have a thin neck, you can make it a little tighter. And then you can make it looser if you have a thick neck. Yeah, really, I like how adjustable it is. So I can make it... So again, just a really fantastic, nice little neck fan that's portable, uh, easy to keep cool during the summer, especially if you're in the South. Uh, and you know, it's just something that you can wear around you, um, take it outside, go anywhere, even if you're just chilling inside the house uh, and you want the extra breeze on you, just, you know, a really nice little neck fan to take. Next up on our list, we've got a, uh, we've got a couple of pet products uh that i'm going to show you uh the first one was done by deer um she's adorable she's always so high energy in all of her in all of her videos and this one is for the petly bro uh cat feeder i've done a couple of petly bro products and they have they are a really nice brand for checking out stuff for your furry friend uh and so this is definitely going to be one um for you this is an automatic cat feeder so if you have a cat i we love these things we have a automatic cat feeder that we use and it is just fantastic for feeding your cats on the schedule they hear that sound they know it's time to eat they run up to it um and then you know it's just it's you're good to go from there essentially all right so we're going to be showing you guys this automated cat feeder so you can actually supply cow or cat power <laughs> you can actually supply power to this feeder via either batteries or through the plug we are using the outlet plug and that just goes in the bottom here so in this little pocket here you can either stick your um your batteries or you can plug the plug that is supplied in right down there into the outlet and then you just flip this switch down here to turn the device on so the next thing that we're going to do is you're gonna go ahead and open this top latch here and we're gonna put some of our cat's food in there For good measure, being you're about to eat like a future cat. All right, Bing. Hey, sweetie. We're very excited. We're very excited. We don't know what this machine is, but we are so pumped to try it out. Okay. Right, sweetheart. Me. I need you to move. All right. Uh oh. Sorry. I'm trying to navigate here. What? There's a microphone. <laughs> Uh, oh, okay, so you can manually, like, set a timer for when it should dispense at any time of day. Well, I just realized I didn't full screen. I'm sitting here watching it on my end, and I looked at the street. I'm so sorry. Uh, the feeder supports up to six meals a day. Uh, you can set multiple meals at different times. Um, but I guess... And there you go. So you hear, so that sound of the food 
hitting the bowl is actually like one of the most important things because when they hear that, that's how they know uh, that there's going to be food in there. And so if you have multiple cats, uh, the way the way we do it with ours, Mulder is kind of like our chonker. So he'll go and eat first. And then Scully, the skinnier, kind of more skittish cat, she'll come in afterwards and, you know, make sure, you know, see what, because Mulder will always leave her some food so she can eat too. Um, and then basically it's just, it's really nice, especially if you're out of the house a lot and you can't always be there for your furry friend to feed them and it's just a really nice little you know secondary thing to have as a backup now on the other end so this one's just specifically for food uh there's ones that you can get for like treats and they have a camera on them which is like one that i covered and this is the this is the Senji Sen dog treat um, and camera dispenser. Uh, this thing is really cool. It's really easy to set up. It comes with its own wall mounting stuff. You just simply uh, pull a strip off and put it on the wall and clip it to where you want to go. Um, and this is really cool because it has a really nice kind of like, not a fish lens, but it's like a wide angle lens. Um, it's really nice to see. You can talk through it uh, so that your pet will know, uh, you hear your voice and come to it and then it will dispense a treat. Um, and it's just something that's really a, a, a cool other thing to have for uh, monitoring your pet and giving them a little snack when you may be away. So this is the Senji Sen pet treat camera and I have absolutely fallen in love with it because of how easy it is to use, how easy it is to install and how well it works with my pets. Now, first off, as you can see, it kind of has like a glossy front to it and a little speaker here. And this is the dispenser itself. And what's really cool about it is that it has two way audio. So not only can I project my voice out of it by using the app that you have to install to use it. So make sure you don't forget that. But I can also hear things that come from the other side. So if like my dog is barking or wincing or something, it can pick that up. What's really cool is that what it lacks from other pet cameras where it has a movable camera this one has a wide angle and it is one of the best 1080p cams I've seen on one of these pet devices. Um, so yeah, it is a very high quality 1080p webcam. At just ever in general. What's really cool is that it also has these load bearing mounts that you can just put on your wall. They're easy that you just peel them off and you stick them and you're good to go. They form a good seal. Make sure you let them sit for a little bit by themselves before you put a weight on them to ensure that they have maximum, um, uh, stickiness to your wall. I meant to say maximum adhesion, but basically that's just it. Make sure you have the app to use it. It's really, it's really easy to use it that, and it's really nice that if you, depending on where you put it, you can always see your pets and see what they're doing and, you know, just know that, you know, uh, what's going on. And if you want to give them a treat and reward them, you can give them a treat and reward them. Now, next up on our list, y'all know me, hydrate or dihydrate. And speaking of which, let me go ahead and do this. Hydrate or dihydrate, everyone. Make sure that you're staying hydrated at every Dragon Blogger stream hosted by me, your boy, Nikita. But speaking of which, um, this is going to be a really important one because this filter is one of the the best things that I've ever gotten from Dragon Blogger, and I love Aquacrest for this. Um, but essentially, so here's... This is a really easy to use, really easy to set up water uh, purifier that you connect to your refrigerator. And I have a Samsung refrigerator, so it already has, um, you know, like a filtering process on it. Uh, but this one uh, basically filters the water before it gets to the filter of the refrigerator. And when I say that my refrigerator dispenses water bottle quality water, it 100% does. It's the best tasting water I've ever had. And as you can see from this picture, this is everything that comes with it. You do not need any kind of plumbing experience to install this. Let me tell you something. I have absolutely none when it comes to this thing, when it comes to the plumbing stuff in general. Um, and so because of what I, you know, how thorough the instructions are, I was able to set it up super easily. It wasn't hard at all. Hi, Shiva. Uh, uh, it wasn't hard at all. And I have enjoyed the quality of it ever since. Up. First, you have to turn off your um, refrigerator line um, to make sure that no water is running when you unplug it from the actual refrigerator. And then uh, once you get the little setting, um, that little uh, screw set up there and plugged into the filter, you want to let the filter run for about five minutes, which is honestly the part that takes the longest is just uh, making sure that you um, flush out the filter. And then you set up this little piece right here 
um, and plug it into the actual line in your fridge and then um, then you take that white uh, cord and you put it into the other end of the filter which is marked out and they're marked in and out so you want to make sure that your refrigerator line goes um, is connected to the out and you want to make sure that the water line is in to in let it flush for five minutes plug it up get the clip set up so that you can mount it to your fridge and then you're basically good to go um i have been enjoying it it's i already ran like a small glass of water to taste it and i can already taste the difference and so i'm excited to use this It's good for five years so if you're in the market for a really nice filter that's compatible with most fridges definitely check this one out and get it set up really do if you're really looking to step up your water game for your refrigerator this is definitely going to be the one for you now next up on our product wheel for the night, the carousel of hope and wonder, we have this really cool 12 inch foam mattress uh, that Merle covered and we get to see his cute precious little pupper in it too. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and get that one played for us. Today we have the crystal 10 inch memory foam mattress. I went ahead and opened this up yesterday, no, two days ago to give it a chance to fully puff up and I've had a couple of nights on it, which is amazing so far. Thank you. So, a couple oh. things is it has several different layers. This top layer is a very stretchy fabric to help minimize motion transfer between the two people, well, whoever's sleeping on it. Underneath that, we have, let me, there's going to be a comfort memory foam layer below this. Below that is a adjustable memory foam layer that helps, it's, it's corrugated, it's wavy, it helps increase temperature, or not increase, but increase airflow. So this- His dog said, I'm gonna go get me a treat and enjoy this match. It does not get very hot. Below that, we've got a fire retardant level. Below that, we're gonna have a high density memory foam layer. And then there's gonna be a layer of springs, which you can see right here, between, sandwiched between those two high density layer of memory foam. Each spring is individually wrapped to minimize motion transfer and decrease the squeakiness from the mattress. And it's surprisingly very comfortable. So if you're looking for a really awesome, nice mattress to pick up, uh, that's, you know, going to come, going to be easy to set up, have a really nice design to it. Uh, definitely check this one out. It's also got a $40 clickable coupon on the page too. Uh, and I promise you that you will not regret it. Now, of course, our most talented dragon blogger, without a doubt, uh, James here is going to cover this really, this, this really fun next product. Uh, it is a harmonica. So we get to, to listen to the, the beautiful sound atronics from our boy James with the East Top harmonica. James here, and today I'm taking a quick look at a new product, guys. This is from East Top. This is their blues harmonica, guys. This is a 10 hole, 20 tone, uh, harmonica this is their i believe t8 uh t 8 k uh organ harmonica guys which is kind of cool this does skip to where we see his little playing oh, easy little thing guys now a few of the other stuff they do have their tones you know you have your blowhole uh blowhole one is like uh your number two and then draw your draw is like b2 so you have your three two fives to turn that down just a little bit he's a beautiful player but who yeah multi-talented so nice easy quick tones guys very simple to use as you guys see inhale exhale you're good to go now this is good for beginners and uh and professionals. Now, I'm no professional by any means. I've never used the Hanukkah in my life. That was actually my second time uh, really testing. I have never used a harmonica in my life. That was my second time. Make it make sense, James. <laughs> in the South. So there you go, guys, from East Top. They're harmonic, harmonica, guys. This is the T-008K. <laughs> 
10 whole 20 tones. Thanks for checking out this quick little video, and I hope you guys have a great day. <laughs> I love James, man. Uh, but he did an amazing job of showing how easy it is to use that 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 really nice harmonica. Uh, very simple. It's got an extra five percent clickable coupon on the page. Uh, if you go to their options or their page, you have different options for uh, the different keys that you want to. That one was in the key of C, but they have keys all the way ranging from A to E flat. Um, so you can you know pick any range that you want to, depending on you know what kind of songs you want to play and what tone or you want them to be in and so um if you're looking for a nice little harmonica i i personally i play woodwinds i don't really know much about harmonica i as you can see i have a guitar back there i just did a guitar video for um for dragon blogger so uh not my expertise of music but uh james did an amazing job on that one and you know so i props to the multi-talented king <laughs> we love james we stand james we're the, we're all james fans here um, James also does the next product where he shows us the really cool uh, Swallow, Swallow Mall Genuine Leather RFID wallet. I love James when he does, um, oh, you can play guitar? Or you can, I mean, you can play harmonica? Or wait, what were you talking about? Sorry. I, there's like a delay between what I say and like what you guys hear. So I just want to make sure we're talking about the same thing. I can't play anything. I can, oh, you can sing? Okay, gamer grandma. Let's go. I I can't sing. I sound like a tone deaf walrus, but you couldn't tell me that because every time I shower, I make sure I take my JBL clip four in there. I play whatever music I want and I go on at least two to three world tours every shower that I take. And I am the king of the concert. Let me tell you. But uh, I don't know if this is the James video where he has the giant wad of cash. I don't think it is. But I love uh, James's wallet videos because he always he always has something that, that makes me laugh in them. I don't know if this is one of them that does, but for the most part, he always has something that makes me laugh. So let's, let's jump right into this one. Just like when you drive. Oh man, when I drive, I know I gotta sound something ferocious because I'll put my AirPods in with, and they have I have the ones with the noise canceling so I can't hear the the outside world and i will just i will sing like mariah carey or anything from the 2000s just with my whole heart i will belt i'm pretty sure i've been in a red light just like singing my heart out and someone has been next to me and watched me and been like he really going through something he gotta be james here today we're taking a quick look at the men's wallet and genuine leather wallet from swallow mall guys this is a leather bifold guys this will hold up to 11 to 13 Nothing can stop me when we belong together comes on. I promise you that that song makes me too powerful. And of course, we're nearing the holiday season, so all I want for Christmas is you is going to be. Play that is when Mariah Carey is at her most powerful. <laughs> Cards plus one see-through ID wallet hole. Now the cool part about this is, guys, this does have RFID blocking, which will block anything from thirteen point five six meg. So for those of you who don't know, RFID is essentially just used for to protect from unauthorized scans where people can steal your information and stuff. So it's just really nice to have that as a feature. Skip to where we actually see the nice wallet. and elegant looking guys. Just a black leather, right? Black or black dyed leather. Then you fold it open and you'll have. Oh man, Whitney! Whitney will have me in my feels. Whitney will have me in my. What's the What's the one song by her? Um, the Greatest Love. Oh, man, I love that song. Your first section of card holders. But I believe the children are future. Your it just, you know, just, right there I, I'll your go. ID I'll go. I'll want, go. Right? Then that's where you'll slide it in. Flip it over. You have another layer of card holders and another layer here. Now, the cool part is, is inside here, you have another pocket to store stuff. You will also flip it over, guys. You'll have two more pockets right here and here. You store stuff. Then you have two in the money folds to hold money. Very simple, very easy, guys. It can hold a lot of. See, I I'm I'm not an '80s child. I'm a '90s child. But growing up, I had a lot of like um 
my family listened to a lot of like R and B and stuff, and so we there was a radio station um, in Houston called Magic One Hundred Two Point One, and they basically had all those songs. But like, I know a lot of stuff from like the sixties, the seventies, especially if it's like um, you know like uh, black artists that are in R and B. I basically know a lot of them. Um, of course, like '90s, like, and I love the year that I was born was the year that Montel Jordan dropped "This Is How We Do It." So you know, I love that song. That's the '90s, and then of course the 2000s, like uh, classics and stuff. So I listen to a, a wide range of music. Yes, I love sm Smokey. <laughs> oh man, you're gonna make me go go pull up my R&B playlist after this. Um, but yeah, I, I listen to yeah, I love all sorts of like the OJ's, Earth, Wind, and Fire. You know, every, every every all around, all around. Cards, which is cool. Now they can hold money uh, if you have a few bucks. You know, I'm getting kind of broke, so you know we just have a little bit of money. Just grab the fold you guys want, right? Throw it in there, and that is how you'll set your money. So a very high utility wallet, uh, very nice. Um, and you know, if you're just looking for something that's really cool with that RFID blocking features, it's just a really nice uh, swallow mall leather to get. Of course, it's made with that genuine leather and it's got a bunch of different compartments where you can put different stuff in. And it's just really good to have a really nice men's wallet. Oh, uh, let's see. I saw him in concert and all the women were going up and kissing him. I was sick, but he was looking to see if I was, oh, so you didn't get to kiss Smokey. <laughs> I've never been to, I've never been to an R&B concert. Um, I'm jealous of my mom because, um, like one of the first concerts that she ever went to was a Prince concert. And I would have, I know I would have loved to see Prince perform, especially Purple Rain. Man, I, I would have loved to see Prince. I would have loved to see Michael Jackson. I I'm so sad that I'll never get to go to any either of their concerts, but, um, no one, no one, it's just no one does shows like, no one does concerts like that anymore. I always see like videos on YouTube of clips from like old school um, concerts and stuff. And it's just, it, you just don't get a lot of great production value out of concerts like that anymore. Like there are a few artists who, who put a lot of work who are really great. For, like Tyler, the creator is a really good performer. Um, and so, um, you know, like I would like to see one of his shows, but not a lot do this do a lot like that also what's up justin let's see mrs dragon Blogger used to book gigs uh and booked one for john paris the oh for real that's kind of cool you saw ozzy elton john and monsters or the monsters of rock okay um i would love to see an elton john concert too i love elton john i the only the only ozzy osbourne song that i really like is the is crazy train um, I've never seen Earth, Wind, and Fire. Um, and me, of course. But, like, uh, you you guys are making me jealous. I'm jealous. <laughs> uh, so, next up on our list, we've got some pretty cool sunglasses. Um, these are the Be A Cool polarized ones. Um, I like these because uh, they fit really nicely on the, on, on the, the head. Um, and the best part about them is that, like, you know, the part where you put the little things on your nose. I forget what the pa the pads, whatever they're called. Um, these, the ones that these have are really comfortable and adjustable. And so I'm gonna let this video do its thing. Nikita with Dragon Bloggers here. And boy, do I have something cool to show you. These are some really cool, be a cool sports sunglasses. As you can see this. Okay, I actually don't know the Joan Jet person. And I'm not really, I'm gonna be real with you. I'm not really a Marilyn Manson fan. This is the matte black color. And I absolutely really do enjoy these things. First off, when you put them on your head, they feel really nice on the side of where your temples are, and it feels really good. Now, what's also cool is that at the, the base of it for the nose, you can kind of adjust how you want it to fit on your nose, depending on your nose needs, I guess. Um, and so that just helps make it more comfortable on your face, but they, they're really sleek. They feel really good on the face. They're really light. And what's cool is if you want to test to see if they're polarized, it comes with this little card. And to you, it looks like there's nothing on this card. But to me, because I have these polarized glasses on, when I look at it, I can see cars on the road, which is just a nice, cool polarization test. Now, what's also cool about these is they come I with know Stevie really Nicks awesome is. kind of mini screwdriver for if you need to do your own repairs to them or not. You can always get like a, a kit 
or something to fix them if something goes wrong. And then it also has this really cool carrying pouch for it. A really amazing microfiber cloth to help clean them off, you know, in case they get like smudges or anything on them. It's really easy to just clean them. And it comes with this really cool carrying case that has a nice zipper on it and a clip that you can put onto like a fanny pack or like your belt loop or whatever. So if you're looking for an awesome pair of sunglasses to have this summer, make sure that you're being cool with be a cool. I thought I was so cool for that pun at the end. Make sure you're being cool with be a cool. And uh, Sunny, when it rains, it pours, just so you know. <laughs> uh, but no, these are some really amazing polarized sunglasses that uh, I definitely recommend if you like them, uh, if you like that style of glasses. Um, they have different colors that you can get. That was the matte black ones. They also come in gray, black, red, black, blue, and white blue. Uh, so just depending on what kind of color um, you want. But they are UV 400 lenses. They're high quality material. And of course, they come with all of those extra little features that I was kind of showing you guys there. Just absolutely amazing amazing okay i've heard of motley crew but i don't know who they are and i love i love bon jovi of course everyone loves bon jovi i also love the bgs i i don't know why i i have a disproportionate love for the bgs um Next up on our carousel, uh, we have this really cool soft sense neck stretcher uh, that James covers. And then he covers a, a really cool massager afterwards. And then I cover um, a kind of a neck stretcher. It's a cervical traction device like this one is. Um, and so I'm going to let James do his thing talking about them. I Yes, I love the Bee Gees. You can't get too much of the Bee Gees, man. James, James, today we're taking a quick look at the new product, guys. This is from Soft since this is their neck stretcher for neck pain and TMGA pain guys this is made out of graphene it is a heating pad style so you do have a velcroed on heating pad that don't talk to me nate I, I don't like you like that you're not supposed to talk to me and edit videos i deserve better i'm joking actually is a good luck on your video editing nate cord on this cord is about 50 make another funny one add me a funny 59 uh 59 inches long guys Plus, it has a plug for three different heating levels. You have low, medium, and high. Those off. So this is a really nice uh, neck massager right here because this one has like a plug-in and heat value too. Um, that's something that mine doesn't have, but this is a, a really fantastic, fantastic neck massager. For three different levels of heat from 77 Fahrenheit. It's basically also an ergonomic cervical traction device too. It's just that this one has a lot more features than the one that I covered does. To 100 Fahrenheit to 122 Fahrenheit. So nice and warm, guys. You wound me, brother. <laughs> it's very simple, very easy to use that. Now, like I said, it's Velcro, so you can unvelcro it and unvelcro it. I even, I, I, is this, is this, is this how you treat someone who got you a birthday present out of the kindness of their heart? Let's see, I tried to do a voiceover and you said something and I repeated it in the voice. <laughs> I'm sorry. It will actually, show you guys the, the the nodes right here. You have six massaging nodes, guys. It will compress. You put your neck on it. First, you lay this down, um, probably near a wall or something, so you can set that down. Put that down there, and then your head will lay towards the wall and, and compress downwards. Now, I did test this out and use it a few times. Um, it's easier to just talk about it, guys, instead of doing it on camera by myself, since I don't have a second person. But simple, easy, guys, to use. It does compress very well, very easily. The How dare me? I, I just, I, I, I forgot my place. I'm sorry, Nate. <laughs> nodes feel great on the back of the neck. This is where you'll actually put your back of your neck. This is where you put your the neck itself. And then your head will lean back here and compress. With the heat, guys, I love medium heat. I think high heat was a little too much for me. Low heat just wasn't enough. Medium heat was just right. Now... After using this, it felt Goldilocks and the heated neck massager. He found the one that was just right. Great, guys. It has the con uh, convex uh, uh, gentle traction. It has the concave on it. Uh, it. Everything fits very, very well for it. Guys, great for horizontal stretching, curvature stretching, and then upward stretching of the neck. It will alleviate the, pains, uh, the pain in the joints and all of that. If you guys need something like that, SoftSense has got you covered. Thanks for checking this video and have a great one guys.
So just, again, a really cool, nice little uh, cervical pillow for neck pain that you can use. It's really cool because it has the heated uh, cervical neck pad that you can use. And as James said, um, the low heat was not enough for him. The high was too much. Medium was just right because he's Goldilocks and the three the three neck massagers, essentially. Um, there is a clippable, clickable coupon um, for 5% off. Uh, this product and it's already 18% off so you can save a little bit extra money if you want to pick this up and these things are absolutely amazing especially um, you know if you tend to have um, you know back upper shoulder problems around like your clavicle region and stuff and this would just help with that now James also does a really cool um, another sort of like uh, self-therapy uh, device with this uh, this sport near uh, deep tissue massager too um, and so I'm gonna go ahead and pull this one up next James here and today we're taking a quick look at a new product guys this is the sport near mini s vibrating body massager or massage gun whatever you want to call it guys now this cool this little item here is pretty cool it's got an intelligent charger that actually times auto times for 10 minute massages at a time and will actually stop once it's done. Now this will go Ooh. five. Oh, I'm I'm so glad you mentioned silverware because I I was I was gonna post something in our little staff Discord uh, earlier today. Do either you or Justin, if Justin can hear me, do y'all have a good recommendation for like a um like a in in drawer um silverware organizer because like we have never had one and like our forks and stuff are just kind of all over the place in a drawer and i really need to get one i was wondering if y'all had covered any that y'all recommend the speed you got anywhere from 1200 to 3200 rpm which is great now you act does come with carrying case comes with all the six heads guys it does have a six hour battery life so you can use six hours of battery life on this now you'll get this and it'll come like this well, if you get any more, Justin, I need one. Some better quality than others. Yeah, I really, I really need one. I'm just tired of like all of my stuff. Being, like, I'm gonna send a after the stream. I'm gonna send a picture of what my silverware drawer looks like, and you're going to uh, to uh, <laughs> scream. All right, I I will do that. I will 100% do that. Nice little case. And then you pop it open, and you'll see the item just like that. Now inside this package, you get the instruction manual. You actually get some extra rubber gaskets. If you need the rubber gaskets, gaskets go on this little uh, massage heads now. You have multiple heads, guys. You have like the, you have ball heads. I'll kind of show you guys some of these ball heads. Then you have. Good, good. I'm so glad. No, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll get you the dimensions, but when I show you what it looks like, you're gonna scream at how bad it is. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this other one out. Bullet style. This is good for penetrating, getting into those nice little areas. You have the hooked or needing. This is good for any area to get in that deep little sections also. Then you have the flat little paddles. I love these ones that are like almost like hammerheads, guys. And then you have another black one. Great little section. Then you have the charger, of course. Just a the one thing that I did got that I use every day that I really enjoy that you sent me was that one that has the uh, you could put like the saran wrap in them. I think mine was also bamboo. It's when you put like saran wrap and you can have like different Ziploc bag storages for it. We use that one like every day. Uh, my girlfriend loves using that one for her meal prep. Regular standard power brick dies. Nothing to really go home about. Then you have the massage gun and stuff. And this is actually very nice. Nice little, it's not super big guys. It's uh, actually feels nice in the hand. Nice little anti-slip. On the side, this is where you'll power it up, right here on this little blue strip. You'll just hold it on. And it's on. That is level one. And then you just adjust that, and it'll start going up and down. I'm not sure you guys will. And hold it off, right? Let's grab one of these. We're going to grab the, the shine. Yeah, it's really expensive because it grows so fast. It, it just it, it grows incredibly fast. Anyone, guys pop it in just like that come back over here and turn it on hold it down and you guys see it going right we'll go through the speeds again i always
always love how massagers look when they're recorded because it, it, it always, it, it, it makes it look more wavy than it is. I don't know what it is about it, but I just always love it. That's on high right there, level five. Let's uh, see what it can do, right? Wait, Nate, did I tell you that I've like legitimately never played Minecraft ever? I think I, I think we had this talk once before. Look at that. Look at that amazing arm jiggle. I love to see it. <laughs> it looked funny. <laughs> Wow. You disowned me? Why are you so mean to me? You know, I'm going to tell you guys. This is really I don't hate quiet. it. Oh, I thought he was going to say I don't hate it. <laughs> There's much pressure as I was putting out. This is super, super quiet. Now, guys, again, this is the Sport Nair Massage Gun. Uh, if you guys are looking for one, this has six heads, of course, guys. And six hours of full battery life on this device. Thanks for checking out this quick little video, and I hope you guys have a great day. So as James said, the Sport Near Massage Gun is just an absolutely amazing uh, deep tissue massage gun. It's perfect for anyone who basically uh, needs to have, you know, muscle relaxation and pain relief. Uh, it's ultra quiet and light rate. Uh, he said it's not too big either. There's a, uh, a clickable coupon for it for an additional 30% off for it too. Not 30%, sorry, $30. Um, it, it has about six hours of battery life. It's low noise, five speed levels, uh, ranging from 1,200 to 3,200 RPM. Um, six replaceable massage heads, as he was showing, uh, which are great for whether you want to massage your back, your neck, your shoulders, your arms, legs, thighs, wherever you want to you know, massage, essentially. And again, it's lightweight and portable, has a nice carrying case to take it around. And so um, you know, if, if, if those hit all all the, the, the check marks for you, uh, then definitely, it's it's going to be one that you want to check out now as we mentioned that first uh one that he or the, the product before this he did a nice little neck massager i did a, a nice little neck massager too it's a cervical traction device and essentially it has the same purpose this, is, this one just doesn't have the heat um it's also at a lower price point too uh so it's definitely worth checking out though my girlfriend was my little guinea pig for it essentially um you can use this not only for just like laying and using, but you can also sleep with this thing the way that it's built. Um, and like I say, I, I, I did sleep with it for about four days. It takes about two-ish days or so to get used to it. Uh, in the manual, they say it takes about one to two days or so. Uh, one to three days rather sorry um and so it's just it's a really nice it does really job and it's a really good job and I, I woke up refreshed uh the week that i started using this i haven't used it since and i really should use it again but it's just really awesome so i'm gonna start right works here and um i'll let her tell you how effective it is so my girlfriend is laying on the ground and she has the neck pillow set up and basically we followed the instructions the cat's trying to get the instructions <laughs> Um, oh, y'all get to see my absolute unit chonker of a kitty, Mulder. He is just one absolute unit. But uh, basically it shows you uh, that you rest in a, a supine position. Uh, you place uh, it behind your neck, which she does. And then it wants you to put your hands basically under Look at um, wait, wait, hold on. some kind of... Look at that chonk. Look at how chonky this cat is. You know, like flat surface and basically push your head back. Um, and that's basically how you use it to work out. Um, she did mention that there was, uh, some slight discomfort at first. Like, look at him! Why he a unit like that for? But it kind of, you know, got better the more she used it. And the device does specify that it takes about one to three days to get used to it. So if you're looking for something that you can use to help basically support your neck and shoulders and help relieve stress, um, definitely check this out. So, I will say Rest Cloud did an absolutely amazing job with this. It can help relieve neck pain in like, I think like ten minutes or so. Uh, and it's just it it it's just really cool to use and kind of lay down and like you know just basically um, help and like I say it really does help relieve neck and shoulder stress too. Um, 
and it's just it's it's easy to to get rid of stiff if okay w one thing that i will say this thing is perfect for too if you wake up with like a crick in your neck this thing will help get rid of it so fast like i promise you uh so if that is a selling point for you because it definitely is for me i definitely recommend you check it out um it's just it's fantastic and rest cloud never makes anything that's that's subpar um the second to last product that we have for tonight is a really nice uh, snorkel set uh, that Demetrius uh, Demetrius did the video for. Um, uh, and so if you want to go ahead and uh, check this out, um, we can go ahead and show it to you. Uh, go ahead and pull this up. Welcome everyone. My name is Demetrius. And today I'm going to be showing you guys this snorkeling set made by Addicope. Yeah, ages range from 5 to 13 that can wear this, but with the adjustable straps, you can fit it up to any size, in my opinion. I am in my 20s, and I can still fit that. It comes with a lot of gadgets, as you can see, for the snorkeling set. And at the price that it's going for right now, it is a steal for this set. Like I said, it has those adjustable straps right there, so any size head can fit that. And then it has adjustable feet, too. So with this right here is is has that gray and black look. It comes in multiple colors also. And it has that solid rubber bottom and grip for whenever you're walking on the cement or on a boat or whatever you're doing. It has that snorkel, which is really awesome, which I'm going to show you guys later in the video. And like I said, it's an awesome product. And as you can see, really awesome and I think that you would enjoy this product. The snorkeling hole has a dry top valve, the very top that makes the air come out so you can be underwater longer. And then you have that a mask clip on that, that uh, the valve, which you can clip that to adjust the height. And then you have the silicone mouthpiece, which is really comfortable whenever you put it in your mouth. As you can see, it is an awesome product and you can see that you know being on the water is no problem at all and then the fins for the feet it just goes smoothly in the water again this is an awesome product and my name is demetrius and thank you guys for watching so demetrius did an amazing job covering this really nice snorkel set um and it's just it's fantastic it's a at a really good price point like he mentions it um let's see you didn't clear gift card website uh justin oh you in trouble you didn't clear the gift card website um <laughs> uh but right now the snorkel set is um about 10 percent off or so um and you can save an extra five dollars with the cl clickable coupon if you're looking for um Animate. no one did i don't i don't know he just came and said you didn't clear the gift card website so i just assumed that you had done something wrong because i don't know how to do that <laughs> uh but i don't think anyone said there was a gift card tonight i didn't say it for sure um but we are on to our last product for the night um it is going to be of course star wars we got a really nice animatronic baby yoda which looks really cute uh, i believe miss rachel covered this one but i'm not sure uh but i'm gonna go ahead and pull this video up it's just a, a little fantastic a uh, little star wars it's a little little grogu this is the star wars the child the animatronic go he stands at a boat Eight inches I guess this is like a six inch pen so you can see his size there on the front you can see the speaker is where all the sound comes from his hands ears head and eyes move and then down here you have the on off and try me so we will turn him on and he's waking up That's his sleeping sound, so he I rubbed him to sleep again. And you can wake him up because now he wants to sleep. That's so I need to get me one of these. Oh my god. Looking at that tiny face. It's precious! He will motion to do 
the force as well. Like rub on his belly sometimes, or his head seems to activate him. Oh man, I'm gonna have to, the ears are so cute. The 3D printed one is better. Oh my God, this is adorable. And then when you want him to go to sleep, you can just lay him down and he gets tired. And then he I'm so jealous. Sleep. I only have like two Grogu things. I, I think Grogu is so cute. So I'm gonna have to uh, pick one up. Also, I noticed the Harry Potter box in the bottom right corner too. So that's that's kind of cool but uh that's basically it for the show tonight y'all uh thank y'all for being here um you know i always love to get to stream for for you wonderful people of the community if you can hear my voice and you aren't currently doing so please make sure you hit that follow button so you can stay up to date with all of our dragon blogger tech and entertainment live shows before i dip i'm just gonna let you guys know about the current giveaways uh so of course, there is the giveaway for the uh, Gigabyte GDG5 gaming laptop or $800 on PayPal by going to www.dragonblogger.com slash win gaming laptop. The deadline is September the 3rd and the winner is announced live uh, September the 4th, two days before my birthday. Oh, y'all, just so y'all know, I got an Amazon stream on my birthday because my birthday is going to be um, in two weeks on that Tuesday. So I actually get to stream for my birthday, which is going to be cool. Um, and so also as uh as justin just showed uh there is a chance to win a nintendo switch Lite plus pokemon legends arceus that ends september 17th and you go to www.dragonblogger.com slash win switch light uh and then uh nate is also doing a giveaway for a darth vader 3d print uh which is going to be uh, at www.dragonblogger.com slash win vader and so um you know you got a bunch of giveaways to choose from that you can enter for um oh thank you so much buy things you might be traveling then well i i wish you safe travels and a wonderful trip uh for when that time comes uh but uh as justin said uh nate will be streaming tomorrow um at his regular time in the morning and i will be streaming tonight of course uh or tonight tomorrow night <laughs> uh i am streaming tonight um when all of Nikita, no, please don't, don't do that. And my dog, <laughs> my birthday is September the 6th, just so you know. Um, no, no, it's fine. I didn't actually say it. I just said I'm going to be streaming on that day. It's two Tuesdays from now. Um, but until tomorrow evening at the regular scheduled time, 6 p.m. PST, 8 p.m. CST or 9 p.m. EST, I am, I am going to be taking my rest for the night. Peace out, Girl Scouts. I hope you all have a <laughs> wonderful rest of your evening. Um, I'm going to punch Nate later. It's okay. Don't worry. He'll be safe. I'll make sure I don't kill him. I'll just, I'll just hurt him just a little bit. Uh, but until then, I'll catch y'all later. And I hope y'all all have a wonderful night. <laughs> Good night, everybody.